Hello fellow engineers and welcome to Moncage. Uh, this is a puzzle game and I haven't played a puzzle game on the channel for bloody ages. It's been far too long, but the dev reached out and gave me a key. Thank you very much. I literally, I've just played like the first maybe minute, maybe two minutes just to see what it was like. And oh my goodness, it's incredible. Really, really fun. I thought it'd be cool to experience it all fresh together. So let's pass the first puzzle by clicking here to start. So this is the Mon Cage, I guess. You can see we can hold our right mouse and we can rotate about. It looks pretty normal, doesn't it? But if you go around every edge, ooh, one of them is a bit weird. You can see into like another dimension. And so yeah, if we, if we have like a proper look around in there, you can see it's just, it's just a load of shelves. There's a suitcase. So we can click and we can zoom in a little bit. And then there's things you can interact with. So we can interact with that and we open up the suitcase. Now, did you see that flash of light on the right? That means that side of the cube, we've got a new a new thing. If we have a look in there, it's sort of like, a, I don't know, futuristic sort of snowy landscape, I guess. Maybe it's not snow, maybe it's sugar. They look like cubes of sugar. <laughs> but as you can see in here, there's, there's a truck with a trailer and it's broken down. That's no good, is it? So being the engineer, we've got to try and fix it. Now, if we go back to this side, you can see in our suitcase, not only do we have a teddy bear, but we have this car, which looks very similar. And you'll notice if we sort of try and match these up, can you see you can get them to line up? And then if we let go, it becomes a vehicle. So if we come back into here, you can see it's been fixed. Now the truck has driven up to here and we've come across a bridge, a broken bridge. Now our engineering skills are really coming in handy. We're going to have to try and fix the bridge. So if we go back to our suitcase, we can double click to zoom out as it says up there. And we can also use space to focus on essential objects. So if we hold space, things will get highlighted. And that sort of shows like the important things that you want to be looking at. So first off, this switch down here, that was highlighted. So we can move that and that will spin that around. We don't really know what that does yet. It looks like this hatch thing is the next thing. So if we try and move that, oh, it looks like it slides but there's boxes in the way. I wonder, yes, we can line them up. So if we let go, you see that's now one bridge and now we can slide it ourselves and we fix the bridge ourselves. And this is as far as I got in the game. So this is all new to me now. I don't know what I'm doing anymore, but uh, our truck has gone in that building, but we got a new area. Ooh, ooh, what's that down there? It's a photo, but it's one of those 3D holographic photos. I'm guessing that might be a collectible as it's gone up there. Uh, so anyway, this is inside the thing. If we press space, you can see that's all lit up. I've also noticed this desk seems to be doing that. So can we, we can zoom into the desk. Oh, there you go. And this lamp, that looks pretty similar. Yes, okay. So if we do that, the weight of the lamp head has lifted up this manhole cover. Oh, but it lets go. Ooh. Ooh, now it's shut again. Did I did I want it to shut? Oh, look, we've opened the top. All right, so I've just seen there's this pulley thing and then that pulley thing. I wonder if we do that sort of thing. No, although they're lined up, they're not really connected. I think we've got to change this one. Back at the desk, we can open the drawer. We've got another photo, a little, little child playing with his teddy bear and someone taking a photo. He's got a beard. Oh, look, and it's the truck and stuff. Right. Look in here, we've got the flower and the plank thing. So I wonder, I've noticed there's a plank up there. Can we line those up? Yes. Oh, and the weight of the flower pot has pulled it off. Nice. Interesting. Now, look, what is that up there? Can we, oh, we can turn the water down and we can fill it back up. Yeah, not too sure. Oh, look, we've unlocked a new, a new area. Cheeky little photo. That's a collectible. Oh look, the guy taking the photo, he's got a cane. He must be quite old. Or is this when he's older? Has the kid grown up and he's left home or something? Nothing to zoom in. It looks almost like a lighthouse, that building. But yeah, nothing too much going on in there, I don't think. Oh, I'll tell you what. That wheel. That's the same as that wheel. What if we fill that back up with water? Oh, the wheel doesn't float. It's attached to a bike. Hmm... Oh, I've just noticed there's another photo in there as well. I probably should have seen this one first because that's the redhead kid when he's still a kid. Oh, I've noticed I can zoom in down there. There you go. Now the wheel's bigger. We can line that up like that. And now that's lined up, I assume I can move this lever and that will move the bike, which will move the pedal and I don't know, something will happen. There we go. There we go. Oh. 
What did that do? What did that do? <laughs> oh, before we zoom out, I, I've just noticed this safe. I can open it. Another photo. Oh, look, it's the ginger kid. I feel like he's a scientist and he's challenging like the leader scientist or something like that. Oh, can I spin it a few times? If I can spin it a few times. Or does it just go back to the same spot? Hmm. Like that lock and that pedal, they're like the same shape. They will line up at some point. And from highlighting all of these, it looks like maybe I can do it twice. I've just realized if I move that back and now do that again, it moves the pedal further. Yes. And now they're lined up. And now the lock's gone because the top of the bar's gone. Oh, that's so cool. Yes, game, you made me think, but I just about got it. I was worried we weren't going to for a second. Uh, now these doors are opened. Everything's moved. Uh, we can zoom in here. All right, we've got an excavator. We've got some barrels. We've got a photo. Oh, it looks like someone went to war, did they? But it's like in the future. There's like a drone. Oh, I'll tell you what. We've now lined this one up with the thing. So if we zoom this one out, we can get the pulley in range, I reckon. So we need to fill that with water so the pulley floats. And then if we go to this corner, they all sit together. Oh, wow. Everything's moving. Everything's moving. <laughs> so the sugar cube truck has carried on. And now we've got this crane arm. I assume we're trying to... Are we trying to get some sugar cubes out? What does this do? Look, grabs grabs a cube and it's put it on there. Where's that gone? And this is like a Wallace and Gromit machine. <laughs> All right, oh look, that lines up pretty well. A double slide. Oh no, I tell you what, I reckon we need to make this arm work first. Because at the moment the sugar cube's going all the way over there and getting sucked up by that thing. Oh, there's also a new a new area. So we can zoom in on this window. Oh, we got some scales. It's on someone's desk. I don't think we need that yet. Let's have a look in the lighthouse. Nothing in there. Okay, so to make this fall down, there's got to be something up the top, I reckon. Shall we empty this with water and then probably zoom in? Oh, I've noticed over there we got a plus. So what is over here? There's another switch. Let's give that a pull and see what happens. Ooh, what did that do? It plonked like a square pot. Oh, we're getting all the pots. All right, so we can't get any more. We've got two. Is that because they're cocked up? Can you see they're not stacked properly in there? Uh, maybe back in this one, we zoom in. Can we do something with the excavator arm? No, what if we go back to the start? Is there something with the excavator? Yeah, there you go. They line up. If we go there. Right, now we can hit the switch. And will that do something different? Oh, it's grabbing a brick. Rather than sugar, we've got a brick. So that goes through here. I think the machine tells it no. And then if we quickly line those up. Quick reaction, yes. <laughs> well, look, and then there's a drone. It wasn't a brick. It was a cardboard box. Oh, and we've unlocked the lighthouse. Man, that is really cool. I re I'm loving the lighthouse. All right, so we've got this fishing pole. We can zoom in down here. Oh, look, there's another hatch. Let's open that up. Oh, we've opened the ceiling. So that's changed what we can do up the top. Oh, dominoes. We got dominoes. And there's a rocket. Is that a rocket at the end? <laughs> oh, and a fan. Right, we've got to turn this on. How do we plug that in? Sorry, I'm probably getting ahead of myself. Let's try and work out what the next puzzle is. Oh, I'll tell you what, that, that lines up. There we go. Oh, look, a cardboard box went in there. You can see it's wedged in there. There's like it's like clogged somehow. So we've got to get one more item in somehow. Is there anything up the top we can actually zoom in on? We can zoom in on this. Oh, there you go. Look, it's a Rubik's cube. Oh, and now it's moving through to another room. And then out there, we've unlocked another side. This one. Oh, look. Oh, is it like a chairlift? Yeah, it's like a cable car. Cool, okay. And we can zoom in on it as well. Alright, so in this one we can zoom in on the computer. It looks like the news is on. Don't like the news. Much better. <laughs> oh, what is this? Is this TV? <laughs> I think this is like how most adults viewed the Teletubbies when that came out. Oh, what the hell? Where are we now? We're in a different room. Oh, and I tell you what, look. There's power down there. It was that one, wasn't it? So if we line that up. Look, the fan is lined up and the dominoes are going. Oh my god, what's going to be through here? It's going to be the rocket. It's going to launch it. Boosh. 
That was quite pathetic. Uh, anything interesting in here? We can zoom in on the desk. Well, there's a photo under there. The son phoned home, it looks like. What a photo. <laughs> Do you remember that time he phoned home, Dad? Well, now you don't need to remember. Now you can just look at the photo and remember. Uh, right, so if we highlight those, it's something to do with the coat hangers. Oh, and maybe that as well. Oh, we can also zoom in on the lighthouse top. We can open that. So that's like a ladder we've extended. I'm guessing that's probably for another puzzle. What if we go back to the TV? Are there any new channels now we're in this room? Oh, every TV show is a different room. We're in like a kid's bedroom now. So is there anything in here to zoom in on? Uh, oh, and look, the coat hangers, they line up. So if we go about there. Nice. Oh, now the battery's coming down. It's going to go into the train. Is it going to power it? Yay! Oh, no, it rejected it. Oh, it needs a blue battery. Do you see that? There's instructions down there. It needs a blue battery. So where do we get a blue battery from? Oh, look, there's a photo under the bed. That kid's face is really freaky. I know it's meant to be smiling, but... <laughs> I wonder if we just keep spamming it. Are there any blue ones at the back or something? No, I think it's just unlimited yellow batteries. It's going to line up with the hammock. Oh, so that's going to drop the telescope into that holder. And then we can zoom in on that. Oh, jets flying over. Bloody hell. Oh, this is a new... <laughs> oh, I love this. That's so cool. Oh, look, we can line up the sun. We can catch the sun. Oh, that was actually a thing. Oh, I made the sun set because the weight of the thing. I didn't even mean to do that. And well, then I guess I can change I can change it from day to night as and when I want to. Okay. Oh, I tell you what, maybe the lighthouse, if we go to nighttime, that will be turned on. Sun, you're going down. And we'll zoom out to there. And then we'll zoom out again. Now look, the lighthouse is turned on. Hmm, not sure. I'm still trying to find the bloody battery. There we go. Yep, yeah, had to be daylight so those colours matched. Right now I can drag that down. And then the battery is down there. Is that useful? How do I turn it blue? <gasps> right, so make it nighttime. And then the battery might be blue. So, sun, you're going down. Right, that took quite a long time. But, super satisfying. Now I've worked it out. I hope I've worked it out anyway. The battery is nighttime. So now we can line them up. Push that back up. Now we've got a night battery. So if we go over here, zoom in on the desk. Line those up. And then when the battery comes down, it's a blue battery. So then the train is going to run. Right, then the train is moving. I feel like I could get that in the lighthouse by doing that. If I can get this top one to line up. So if we zoom out there, does that help at all? No, we need to change the top one somehow, I think. Oh, look. I did it. <laughs> I lined them up. And now the train is spinning the lighthouse. Nice. And now we have a new scene for that one. I feel like I accidentally completed that puzzle. There are no accidents. All right, so if I hold space, I can see that is completely lit up, like the whole island, which usually means I need to, like, link that with something. I literally can't find anything on any face of this cube that also lights up like that. Uh, the game has just given me a hint thing. So if I come up here, you can see we've got these two hints. So you can hold this, do a bit of that. Uh, it's too dark in the room. Where to find the light? Okay, so... I'm looking at this broken cage again. It sort of lines up with those stairs. Ah, there we go. And now there's light in that. Oh, look, it's lighting up stuff in the background. What's oh, a switch. Do I need to have good timing? There you go. Switch. We've turned the light on in the room. Nice. So if we zoom out, we can see there's light over Oh, there's a switch down there. That was hiding. What does that do? It opens those doors. And now we're in some sort of rocket room. What if we open this hatch? There's all sorts of switches everywhere. What's in here? Another switch. Shall I see what it does? Okay, it's turned fans on. Alright, with them turned on, if I zoom out, does that do anything? I feel like this is like a nuclear bomb. <laughs> and I've just turned it on. Is that a good idea? What does that one do? Oh, we're going down. We're going down the missile. Oh, look, there's a pulley. That's the same as the chairlift one. So if we zoom out of the chairlift one, that's going to line up almost exactly. There we go. And now that basket went all the way down there. 
Interesting. Oh, look, and then this pram lines up with that. There you go. That's the same color one. That's why we put the same color one on the chairlift system. So we just had to wait for that. And now the teddy bear's going down. No, he's fallen off <laughs> into the water. Oh, it splashed. I don't know if you saw that. I think to the right and to the top, we opened up new puzzles. I think we're going to have to carry this one on next time, though. I am absolutely loving this game. It's so damn interesting. But yeah, if you want to see if you want to see another video of this, guys, please push the old like button. Hope you enjoyed watching this as much as I did playing this. It was really, really fun. Anyway, check out the link in my description if you want to play the game. I put a little Steam Store link in there. But otherwise, peace, love, and drowning teddy bears. Bye, guys.